Hi guys, Brian West with Virtual Frasier. Recently, it was brought to my attention that the museum has put up a new display for our cool Kentucky exhibit. So I decided to go downstairs to the offices of our exhibits team to ask a few questions. Hey John, oh, how you doing? Oh, I'm, me. I'm sorry, man. Hey, you told me there was something that you just uh, put up in the museum? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I did. Can you show me? Sure, let's go. Brian, I know how much of a UofL fan you are and how much you like basketball, so I wanted to show you this new installation of the Final Four and Championship banners from Kentucky and UofL over the last, uh, what, 50 years? 60 years? Oh, wow, John. Years. Oh, my goodness. You even have the vacated banner. Absolutely. That's beautiful. They That's won it but they didn't win it, but they won it. Now you told me that you were gonna find some, you had some other banners for me to keep as souvenirs? I do actually, you're gonna love them. Oh great, so where are they? They're down in my office, let's go. John also showed me some other banners that he was able to create for the Cool Kentucky exhibit. Some that were made just for me. Check them out. Oh, uh, interesting. So you have 08 Final Four and 07 Final Four. 97. Okay, well, John, I hate to break this to you, but um, these these are, um, um, well. Erroneous? No, uh, I was thinking more of um, fake. Well, we all know how much uh, U of L fans like fake manners, so I thought you'd like that one. Yet, with even the care and dedication put into bringing up those banners for a cool Kentucky exhibit, there was one glaring omission, which was brought to our attention by Amanda Brady, our curator, and Megan Shaney, our manager of school and teacher programs here at the Frazier. What about the ladies, Brian? Yeah, Brian. So thanks to Amanda and Megan, we're able to round out the picture of the history of college basketball in the Commonwealth with the addition of three more banners, those in honor of the final four teams for the University of Louisville's Women's College Basketball Club. And so we are very proud to have this new addition to our Cool Kentucky exhibit. So please, feel free to drop on down to the Frasier to have a look at them. Otherwise, on behalf of the staff and crew here at the Frasier for watching.